some more cyberpunk. fair. I help? No, you can't. I'll be done soon. The Raffins left are crooked as a bag of snakes. Did you sleep all right? Can't complain. And you? Reasonably rested? I think you had nightmares. You screamed a few times. Really? Don't worry. I'm accustomed to that sort of thing. When Mitch and Scorpion came back from the war, they tossed and turned night after night. For months, this went on. Whatever it is, it'll pass. Mm -hmm. Let's hope so. Come up with anything? For Hellman, I mean. As a matter of fact, I did. Look here. Okay, tell me. We're the wrench. The cutter is the AV. And the screwdriver is where the AV should bury its nose cone in the dust. Now, you must be wondering how we get the AV to do that. That old HMG of yours? My gun will be useful elsewhere. This caliber would barely dent the armor of a heavy hitter like that. There are other ways. Here, the clamps are solution. A satwave power station. Why down the AV there, at that exact spot? Because once it's on the ground, we'll have to locate it and grab your target. As fast as we can. And the terrain there is typical California desert. Flat, dry, and empty. There'll be a big old sitting duck. Power station. Wait, you want to use an EMP? Bullseye. But how? We can't generate that sort of pulse on command. Would you like to bet me? We drive up to the power collection unit, break in and override the controls, lift any limiters. As soon as the AV is in range, we set off the electromagnetic turbo pulse. This should smoke the AV system. So the drive, nav systems, communications, everything, out like a light. They won't stand a chance in hell. Aren't you, uh, counting chickens? We can't actually know the AV will fly over the station. Of course we can, but we don't have to. You'll see. It's bound to be quite a ride, but not one you'll regret. I've got everything planned out. Remember, need Hellman alive, unharmed. Gotta train not to blow the AV to bits, okay? I know, but I'd say your man had best be buckled in. This idea, if it works, you'll be in for a rough landing. All right, let's ride. Great. Hop in. It's cold out here.
Who owns this power station? Gov or Corp? Is there any difference? Who do you think pulls the government's strings? I'm just wondering whose toes we're about to step all over. V, look around. It is simple. Everything you see is owned by a corporation. You like to mess with the corpse, huh? Whatever gave you that idea. Or wait. Scratch that. Rogue, Nash, the Raffins... You're on thin ice, B. You just like to mess with everyone. Well, then I suppose it's a good thing I'm on your side, isn't it? Mm-hmm. And now for something completely different. Weirdest thing you've ever transported. Go. What? Are we playing 20 questions? Come on, answer. The deputy finance director of Kaukaz. A chauffeuring, not smuggling. He rode in the trunk. Flatlined. Really? Dead? A long story. Maybe someday I'll tell you. We've almost reached the dam. We'll make a quick stop here. We need to calibrate you with a turret. I want you to be able to use the gun, too. It should up our chances in general. Connect here. How should I connect? Personal link? How else? Just watch the jack. Sometimes you have to jig a little bit. Wired in. Wait a moment. Diagnostics first. Shit, it keeps giving me an error. Odd. Let me work around it. And now, Pan Am, here's Johnny. Out in the middle of bumfuck nowhere. Great work, V. Hey, uh, I think your implant has a virus. The one in the nape of your neck. Uh... I've got a bioprocessor in my head that operates independently of me. Probably why your diagnostics flagged it. Mm-hmm. Okay. But no data will leak out of it through the personal link. You're right, Secure. Fine. I trust you won't fuck anything up. Okay. Here goes nothing. See that pile of junk? Fire a short burst into it. I'll take care of the calibration. Target. Single shot. Okay. Just one more. Longer round. Great. We're done, I think. Now that wasn't so bad, was it? Calibration's fine, but your soft could really use an update. Scanner controllers all a couple generations back at least. There's better tech in the bargain bin at a Kabuki flea market. I can help you with that, you know? Yes, sure. The most important thing is that it works now. So where's this power station? You will see in a moment. I know a spot. We'll have a decent view from there. I just want to be sure the area is clear. Sabotage a Corpo power station. Jump a Corpo transport. Kidnap a corpo suit. This a plug for the word corpo, or do you have a point? Know what? You're starting to remind me of me. Fifty years back. Minus the charisma. An impressive cock. Hmm. Maybe we can just get along. Let me remind you. I want Hellman for me, not to stick it to Arasaka. This is life or death. My I mean, let me death. remind you that Sokka and their fucked up tech is what got you here. Who gives a shit about motives? Ends justify the means, and right now your end is to survive. All looks clear. The area looks deserted. I see no patrols. The huge thing is the collection unit. And see the antennas? Each antenna collects microwave energy from satellites in orbit. That's then converted into electric power. Antennas run a ways down the interstate. We set off a chain reaction that starts in the collection unit. 
Then each antenna will emit a massive EMP burst. While our AV flies right into our net. We just have to send out the pulse at the right moment. Let's go get her. When we arrive at the station, you overload the systems. I'll set up a bypass link for the detonator. Why don't I start with the transformers? Make mayhem in the relative voltages. The rest should move faster after that. Not a bad idea. That's just... Yeah, yeah, I know. The converters. But they shouldn't be a problem. I'll just crank everything up past max. Seems we think alike. So what now? We wait. We should time our arrival to the AV flight. Got it. Good. Time to roll. Done anything like this before? Downing an AV? By myself? No. Why do you ask? Power station, EMP, the systems, networks. Came up with a really solid plan. Thank you. How you approach things, that's the trick. Mine is the AAA. What now? Assessment, assembly, action. Whatever your task, you do three things. Start by assessing what you already have and what you'll face. The problem. Then you plan with those variables in mind. Take what you have, get what you need, assemble things, people. Finally, you take action. Simple. Got one word for you. T-shirts. Triple A. It's all you need to lead the good life. That and the occasional cold beer. Your method, Triple A. That all you? <laughs> Not at all. I learned it from the Elder Caldos. Mitch and Scorpion. They were trained in something like it during the war. Then they made it their own. It's come in handy, I can't deny. And it will again now. What if, uh, something goes ass up? Well, then your ass had better improvise. Did you really think I'd just give you a foolproof secret to success? Gotta say, almost had me believe in just that. You're too much sometimes, V. Okay, we'll be there in a moment. One last time. We drive in, fuck up the system, and get the hell out of there. Hold on tight. This could get a little bumpy. Get ready. Okay. I'm ready. at 11. You got to look. Yeah. Let's get out of here before it lights us up too. V, get the fuck out before something happens to the chip. Thanks for the tip. You know, I was just about to set up a picnic. Maybe lay out, work on my I base. I mean it. Team. Watch out. The next one might. Johnny? Johnny? Fucking hell.
okay. I'm fine. It's... It's okay, just... It's okay, I'm fine. Yeah. Just... Delta the fuck out. Not the cleanest job, perhaps, but it still went well. What about the detonator? Is it working? Yes, it's working. And I don't even see a drop in the signal strength. We just need to drive far away enough to keep the pulse from blasting us, too. The cliff there. We'll set up. It should give us a good view of the antennas. And then we wait. Okay. Here. Always wanted to push the big red button on something like this. How do we know when? Don't worry. I'll have eyes on it. You just wait for my signal. Then set off that pulse. They won't know what hit them. And by the way... What? We are about to knock a multi-million euro dollar Kang Tao asset clean out of the sky. How does that make you feel? Blasting shit. Exactly what the doc ordered. And that's exactly what I like to hear. Just noticed. What? It's quiet. The hum of the city, people's voices, the smells. It's all gone. Wind just intensifies it. I think I forgot quiet exists. Mm-hmm. Though maybe not the smells. I mean, the coyotes. Rather hard to miss. Thought that was just the air freshener in your Thornton. Ha ha. Screw you. You'd do better to focus on the AV. Keep your eyes open. It's there, coming from Pacifica. All right, get ready. One more second. One more. Now! Boom. There she is. Shit! What's, What's happening? Fuck. Fan fucking Bullseye! Fantastic. Pan Am, the engines are still running. Fuck, they're getting away! They're going nowhere. We gotta go after it! Give me a moment. Pan Am, what are you doing? <laughs> That's how you do it. It's losing altitude. We got the bastard. Let's go. We got it. No way it stays in the air after a blast like we that. Land or crash. You catch that? Over. Over. AV, unmarked. Losing out. Fetch, there. Scorpion! What the hell are they Finishing doing? Finishing up at the generators. Follow them. On my way in a bit. Battery Mitch, should sort Scorpion? itself out. It's Pan Am! Don't go near that AV! I repeat, do not approach the AV! On the way, or I'll start the party without you. It's Kang Tao! Wait for me! Or better, get the hell out! They probably want to help the survivors. Without knowing it's corporate. They can't hear me! The pulse is interfering. Drones? Yes. Get ready. They're trying to slow us down. We won't let them. We have to reach Mrs. Scorpion.
Pan Am, you okay? Fucking okay. ricochet. Think you can manage? Sure. I'll live. Don't worry. Hey, man, where are you? Hello? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Scorpion? Keep broadcasting over an open channel, just in case they missed you the first time. God, I swear. Something's not right. Did you hear those shots? V, something happened to them. Let's check it out. I see the wreck, but no Scorpion or Mitch. Looks expired. V, connect to the drone. We'll scan the area. We have to get our bearings. Let's roll. You connecting to visual? Mm-hmm. V, if they got the Aldecaldus, if they got Mitch and Scorpion, I can't... I don't... I know, I know. Connected. I'm in control. Combat drones. Defense systems active. They secured the area. They're waiting for reinforcements. Shit. V, this does not look good. Fucking corporate rats. They've set up the launcher. They'll tear us to shreds if we get too close. Mitch! He's alive! They have them! Can we take it down somehow? Maybe. But we have to get there first. Got five kings on patrol. doing why in the hell were they following the av the fools listen we saw mitch they probably got scorpion too we'll find them help them out if they're still alive they're alive everything's gonna be okay mind that launcher it will blow us to bits if we approach you're already blown to bits don't be an idiot this is just a scratch let's take out the launcher I will try to- No, you stay in the car. Sorry, but you're just gonna slow me down. Fucking hell, V. Those are my people out Listen, there. Listen, I get that launcher out of our way, I'll let you know. Then you go in and help me with the rest. Deal? Yes, ma'am. I still have Mitch's rifle. I will try to cover you from here. Good idea. Let's move.
support. Oh, God damn. Open the door. I'll cover. Refusing to cooperate. Now, step back, back. Toss your weapons, or I'll shoot. I repeat. Easy now. Drop your Not weapons. Not too late for now. everyone to walk out of this alone. We called for backup. Bullshit. Last chance. You don't gotta die today. Let's talk. Why should I believe you? Pan Am, shoot Shut him. Up. Listen. This isn't about you. Let him go, and tell me where I, your passenger is. I, I don't know where they took him. Hell no! He's lying! You don't know, or you don't want to say? Let me get the comms back up. I'll buzz the unit. We'll talk. Pan Am! But only if you remember the Shut cowboy, the don't up. you? Fuck! Pan Am! God damn it! Oh shit! Are you alright? Eh, uh, just some scratches. You fucking morons! Did you get hit? Hang on, girl. Subject I'll pass you up. Let's go. <laughs> we couldn't retreat. They were grouped so fast. Started shooting rockets and shit. I lost everyone. Everyone? Scorpion, is he here? Mitch? Mitch? He's... He's safe, Pan right? Am, I'm sorry. I didn't make it in time. No. No! Are you sure? No, he... Requesting support. <laughs> Scorpion, the rest, I... I'm sorry we didn't get here sooner. They were good people. Great people. They didn't have to die here. I should have stopped him. I tried. He wouldn't have listened to you either. Never was much of a listener. Stubborn bastard. I'm guessing since you were out here, you were out here for the AV. The question is why? We need the guy who was riding this AV. You know anything? See anything? Took him with him. In our cars. Where? West. Small unit. Your passenger's entourage. Must be looking for a way to call base. So you're the ones who hit him with that EMP? Yeah, we tried to warn you, but we couldn't connect. The 
If they took your cars, we might be able to follow their tracks. Kenem, listen. I know it's not the best time, but I need Hellman. You promised to help. That still hold? I always keep my word. Mitch, I will find those sons of bitches. I swear. Go. I'll call the crew. Get all this cleaned up. We'll leave my ride here just in case. We'll go by bike. Sounds good. Kang Tao lost contact with their AV. Probably looking for it. Better hurry. But Pan Am. What? You're coming back for her, right? I promise. Subject refusing to cooperate. Like a rescue party. I want my epic loot, goddammit. What the fuck? Scorpion and the rest. Look, I know how you feel. I mean it. I'll help you settle your score with Kang Tao. I will destroy them, V. Every last one. We're in this together. To the bitter end. You know what, V? You're all right. You help me with Nash, you help me with Mitch. To my mind, I owe you a favor. Your Hellman. I will find him. Ah, so that's what this is? Just paying your debts? No. No mats only. Oh, so I'm one of yours now. Sounds good. Let's ride. Hope they didn't go far. We'll see. The tire tracks start there. No oh, we'll shit. Follow. Not good. Our guys were here. Let's follow. Find them. Where the fuck's the motorcycle? Scorpion said I would hate Night City. He knew you that well? Probably better than I know myself. He said when I'd had enough of the city, we would stock up on canned kibble, fill a couple of thermoses with coffee and whiskey, and hit the road. He said we would get away from it all. Sounds like a real adventure. Yeah. But it's a Shit, B. Why is everything shit, shit, shit? Hey, I know. But look. You're alive. So got a few things to take care of, too. Where the fuck am I supposed to be going? You know it.
Fuck! Jesus Christ. Supposed to be seeing something. Ahead of us, see him. Oh, shit. Slick moves, V. Nice work. for the festivities. Well, that's that. It's not, I guess. Turret! Oh. The rest must have taken home and with them. If they manage to regroup and call for help, we're out of luck. Better hurry then.
moonshine. It's like I'm playing Red Dead. One of our one of their rides. Let's check it. Don't know if we'll find anything else here. Enough. There's nobody here. Better check where King Tao took him. Fast. You were right. Nomad's car did die. They tried to put her back on her feet. But the oil pump died. Pistons couldn't take it. Gave us a few minutes, maybe, but they still got a head start. Left a few peeps behind at the airstrip. Rest went with Hellman. I would have done the same. They're looking to call their people. The last they want is to ride through the desert without backup. I hope Mitch contacted the Alda Caldos. All that damned interference. They're coming for him. Don't worry. You know what? What? This is my life right here. I step out of one pile of shit, only to trip into another bigger one. Pan Am. And pull in everyone else after me. I'm done. You hear me, B? I fuck up again. You better give me a good kick in the ass. But you didn't fuck any. Promise me. All right, I promise. Man, I need that motorcycle. Definitely need those motorcycles. It sucks that I kept following that shit. But... Riding in the desert on a horse with no name. That's a base up there, maybe. These tracks lead up past the hill to an old filling station. That's where they're holding helmet. Oh, so far away. There's my car.
They will regret this. Drones, patrols, definitely set up shop here. I see. They must have Hellman locked up somewhere. Buffy, see that? The pumps look pretty good. Not what you would find if the place were closed. The bastards might have managed to call for transport. We'll know soon enough. Vicious activity detected. What the fuck is that? I mean, there's dudes everywhere. Trouble. God 
tiene. Shoot, I'm unarmed. The hell are you doing here? This is my station. Name's Martin. Those fucking suits rode up like they owned the place. Took everything. Put me here and locked the door. Brought a man with him. A man I need. Civilian. You must have spotted him. Mm hmm. I ain't blind. Where are they holding him? Old garage. Room upstairs. Probably keeping them there. Thanks. I were you? I'd stay put for a few. Exactly my intention. Know where they're keeping Hellman. Going in. Okay, covering you. Resistance is too less. Don't look too concerned. Ain't my first rodeo. Once the dust falls, the problems disappear one way or another, and I I just dust myself off and get back to work.
We gotta talk. Who are you working for? You're in Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back? What a shitty brat. He's about to either scream or run. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. I cannot stand. Fuck. Don't take this personally. Seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got home. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Just remember, you have Hellman, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something with it. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. He's no friend of yours. Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive? What did he say? Alive. Alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Better take him somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Like your new chimbas are here. Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder talents. <coughs> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Just gotta ask him a few important questions. I sure hope you get some important answers. Saul. Everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. Saul, I tried to race Scorpion. Maybe I could help out somehow? I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Well, Saul, so, it really wasn't Pan Am's fault. Careful. You and me are not buddy-buddy. Besides, nobody's blamed anyone for anything yet. Sure. Right. Pan Am was just helping me. It was my doing, my fault that AB got here. Without me, Scorpion and his people wouldn't have gone out to that's the truth. When you're an Aldo Caldo, you are always responsible for yourself and your people. The circumstances change nothing. Perhaps Pan Am should ask herself if she's still an Aldo Caldo. She tried to get him involved. Damn it all. Hey, don't worry about Saul. I'll get over it. I don't give a damn. But he gives a damn about you, Pan Am. As soon as he heard what had happened, he ordered us to follow you. He was worried something would happen. Saul? That was his? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but your family and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. <laughs> I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But I will manage it. And you. You look out for yourself, all right? 
So, what now? Back to Night City? Yeah. I mean, I think so. I have to sit and think. About everything. Think that's it. Till next time. They're coming. You got a minute. Let's move. Until next time. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours now. Sweet. What did I do? Sit on the dude on the way back to town?
What is this place? Motel. Middle of nowhere. Any specific middle? Doesn't matter. You're not leaving here by yourself anyway. Why are we here? Wanna talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for Arasaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arasaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. Nobody sent me. I got a problem, and you're gonna help me. And what does that have to do with the biochip? Got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy. And I know it's only gonna get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that? None of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the final Silver fight. Hand. Constructed. That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Long story. If Arisaka finds me, I'm dead. So are you. So we are in no hurry. And I'm interested. Truly. Clept it off your Nobu, Arisaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out and to And you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. I know you can't just yank it out. My ripper you said- You showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was downing a Kang Tao AV? How's the prototype version different? It's got a different- Ingram, something more... Aware? Aggressive. The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's Engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved Engram. It was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the Engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. How exactly was this new version supposed to work? Are you planning to have the Engram kick people out of their own bodies? Is that shit by design? During the tests, we assumed that the body would be... ...neurally indifferent during implantation. You mean dead? Yes. Which makes what happened to you interesting indeed. How do you put a price on immortality? Who could even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in-house. The prototype was Saburo Arisaka's personal commission. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for you, Arinobu, nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. This is a true breakthrough. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Whoa, we just met. Haven't built up that sort of trust yet. How did you think this was going to go? If you want me to help you, I must examine you. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this suit's the one who's gonna help us. What is it? 
What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could Woo do... Woohoo, it's bargaining time. ...is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. Wait, you said the project was in the trial phase. You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against it. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I can see him. ...and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Jeez, give it a rest. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn It's not host. as if one of you wins the debate. The scale simply shifts. Slowly but surely. What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomber. Well, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny! Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. You know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you. If you come with me to Kangtao. I'll try, just isn't gonna cut it. Actually, it's almost like you're trying to buy your way in with the Chinese at my expense. Do you even realize how much data is in your head? Even if I can't help you, the data must be saved. Well, fuck me sideways. What a half-brain gonk. You just admitted you're right. Forget King Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got it. Gonk's fucking useless without him. V. Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice. He might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. Than nothing, long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. What'll you do with him? I haven't decided yet. Are you serious? You know me, I can be impulsive. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is positively parched. Mm. V did not give you even a glass of water. 
Unacceptable. Inhuman. That is not me. You will see the difference. <laughs> I will give you full buckets. No, uh, no need. Ugh. What the? Sit down, goddammit! So, ready? Of course it's the damn chip! My silver handosis is clearly incubating! That appointed finger I hear in your voice? Fuck! That was your ticker. Sit and rest. Don't need your flat money while we got a job to do. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Fuck Arisaka, blah, blah. Smash Makoshi. You really are turning into me. <clears throat> Can't say I'm excited, because... You're a manipulator, an egotist, and a cynic. Every time you open your mouth, you gotta bury someone. You know, we get along as the need arises. Maybe it's time you started trusting me more. You can be a charming guy. Just make the effort. Charisma flows. Then I remember that nuke that you detonated downtown without a second thought, and no hint of later remorse. It was Makoshi I was after. Wanted to destroy it. Gave Sokka ample time to clear the building. You knew countless people would die. Don't kid yourself. Take lives aplenty yourself. See scale as a problem? Point. Guess we make quite the duo. No, we're not the same. What I did in Sokka Tower, no doubts, no regrets. Might fool someone else with that, but I call horse shit. What do you know? Got no idea where I'm going. Be a living legend. That's all I wanted. Feels like I'm barely surviving. Test of a person's true value? Death. Facing it. Staring it down. You still got a chance to be somebody. Yeah. Maybe. What was it like? When you died? Was on top of the world. Failure not an option, not a thought. Till it happened. Death feels real now. It's only now I know it. Now? Had half a century to come to terms. Makoshi felt, I don't know, like sleep? Lacked awareness, had no sense of passing time. Didn't mark it. Did what they wanted to me. I just remember cold, a black void, fear. Or. Or was that your death? Makoshi, why did Arasaka even build it? If I could only see inside Saburo's head. Ah. Uh -huh. People can be bought, brainwashed, but it's only in Makoshi that you can peer inside a soul, pick it apart, reprogram it. They've amassed quite a collection. Scary, talented runners. Soul killed. Packed away. Probably using them now. Probably controlling them. So, wool in hearts and minds. That's what it's about. Uh, the usual. 
Corps have always tried to shackle people one way or another. Saburo's ambition is greater. He's out to control humanity. Ma, oh, I think I get why you detest the place. Shouldn't exist. Of all the destruction and pain Corps wreak around the world, what happens at Makoshi is worst. You know why? Because you're trapped there forever. It's eternal. No, nothing's eternal. And for the Psyches and Mikoshi, no such thing as the passage of time. Worse things when they switch up your identity. And you never even know you've become someone else. Corps have already taken the world for their own. Now they're coming for us. Realize what you're doing to me is what Arasaka's doing at Makoshi. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm gonna fix it. Let's move. Get back to work. Let's do. V, I heard you had a gig for me. You heard right. I need a driver. Mm-hmm. And for what exactly? Oh, you know, this and that. I got a few errands to run. A couple of friends that need paying a visit. The usual. Listen, I'm a straight shooter. So let me cut right to the chase. 
I heard you're the best in town. Thing is, I like working with the best. And I know the best don't come cheap. I'm not gonna get into the nuts and bolts, cause if what they say about you is true, you can handle anything. So let's get this settled. You got what it takes? Or are they wrong about you? All right, I'm in. Japantown, then. By the market entrance. Get a few honks and I'll stroll up. Later, V. Hey, Judy. How you feeling? Shitty, but something came to me. So what did you come up with? The monks died. Lizzie's bar used to be a joy house. Tiger Claws killed one girl too many, so people took matters into their own hands. Belongs to us now. Clouds could stand to get the same makeover. I'm familiar with the story. Things did not go that smoothly. I didn't say they did. Didn't say they would. But Evie thought Clouds would be safe. You saw how far that got her. How she ended. V. I can't stand by and let things go on like this. Got the mocks to agree to take over Clouds? No, I'm trying to get you. No, someone at Clouds will take our side. Will you help? Fine. Got me on board. Ooh, yes. Okay, so what's the plan? First up, we gotta talk to Michael Maeda. If she's not with us, might as well throw our hands up in the air. Michael Maeda? Who is she, exactly? Girl who unofficially runs clouds. Good at it, too. What's she do officially? She's a doll, so she's a nobody. Sure Maiko's gonna want to join forces? If I was sure, I'd be on the hollow to her and we wouldn't be having this conversation. Let me rephrase. Any chance she'll slap us around and shove us out her mega tower window? Of course, sure. Guess I can work with that? How well do you know this, Maiko? Too well. When are we doing this? Early morning. Clouds will be closed. Hardly a soul lurking at that time. How early? Before eight. I'll be by the entrance. Oh, scratch that. The balcony above clouds. We'll sneak in. No one needs to know we're there. On the balcony. Got it.
though we haven't met. I'm Elizabeth. Hey, you're V. My yes. husband and I, we Ooh, need a somewhat fuck. delicate matter You didn't handled. answer my question. We think you could help. What's so delicate about the matter? I'd rather discuss that in person, if you don't mind. Can we meet? Sure, let's do that. I'll send you the address. See you. Yeah, that's me. Good. Then let's go. Where to? Little China. I have a craving for Kung Pao chicken. Extra spicy. Doesn't that bother you? What? The grenade. You know, the one in your face? Uh, you get used to it. I just gotta be careful not to pull the pin when I wanna pick my nose. <laughs> nice out here. A lot of stuff has changed. Where are you from? Brazil. You know, down in South... I know where Brazil is. <laughs> you never know with you gringos. This is the place. Wait for me here and keep the engine running. We came all this way to get takeout? You could say that. Needs up your ass, too? told me what you were planning from the get-go. That's true what they say. You're good. Really fucking good. Got a stick up your ass, though. This is where we part ways. Good luck, V. And, uh, relax a bit. Okay? Not only to you. What about my payment? What about it? Here. Like I said before, the best don't come cheap. Take care, V. And hey, keep your nose to the ground. For your eyes do not belong to you, or rather, not only to you.
how you're doing, honey. Listen, got a golden opportunity for you. Word on the streets that when Waco says golden, it's usually a turd wrapped in crepe paper. It's a sticky situation. So, what's the spec? someone? Wait, this isn't the Dalai Lama? Must have gotten the wrong number. You didn't arrive in this pond yesterday, V. You know how the fish gets sliced. The perp been proven guilty? Meaning he deserves to die, truly? Do I look like a criminal prosecutor to you? What'd he do, exactly? I'm not a beat reporter, neither. You want the job or not? All right, I'm in. Good. Client will be waiting for you by a car at the corner of 6th and Brandon. Oh, huh? in a car? I got a street. Client wants to tag along. Be there in person when you put a bullet through the guy's eye. Good luck. Are you V? Please, step in the vehicle. Okay. Hello, V. I'm Jefferson Perales. You've already spoken with Elizabeth, my wife. Perales? The one running for mayor of Night City? The one. So, the one who was DA until recently, but just vaulted into a seat on the city council? I gather you now understand why discretion is of the utmost importance. So, what do you got for me? Carter, let's go. Straight to the matter at hand, huh? <laughs> My time's pretty valuable. Pretty sure yours is too? True. Elizabeth? Well, as you're probably aware, Mayor Lucius Rhine recently passed. We want to know how, why, whatever else is pertinent. Far as I remember, someone tried to zero Rhine a few days before his death. The NCPD sees no link. They're saying it was a random cyber psycho attack. And. Claiming the mayor died of natural causes. Causes unrelated to the attack. It's in the official reports. Ryan died at home due to a cardio implant malfunction. These suspicions of yours wouldn't have anything to do with the upcoming election, would they? Of course they would. If Lucius Ryan was murdered, we want to know. Need to know. What makes you think the cops got him wrong? Got any evidence? Shortly before Ryan passed, he made cuts in the NCPD budget. Perhaps got on someone's bad side that way. In any case, we have the cyber psycho attack on a BD. Our chief of security scanned it, but didn't find anything out of the ordinary, so to speak. We need a brain dance editor, a real one. It's raw footage. The brain dance. It has to be back where it belongs today, or a lot of people will be in a lot of trouble. If you agree to help, you can see it right now. Where'd you get the scroll? Ryan was making a public appearance. BD scrolling standard procedure for events like that. Following the attack, the NCPD impounded the footage as evidence. We had to pull many strings to extract it. All right, see what I can do. Excellent. We'd be happy with any find that would clarify things. Alleviate lingering doubt.
Well, what do we got here? Question is, what are you doing here? My brain too, isn't it? And this time, don't go scrolling every ass you see. Eyes on the mayor. Stuff belongs to City Hall. Let's make it PG. The Hulk guy. No idea. Those ass clowns are all the same. Second contact in three days. No idea what this place is that, for. That's why I'm mayor and you're not. Now's when we need the visibility. You're spreading yourself too thin. I'll rest tonight. My room at the Red Queen's race is ready. Yes, of course. Good. Now go. Gotta practice. Red Queen's race. Cause any intersynapse zaps? Sure, a bunch of old Brit farts and powdered wigs shouting, Off with their heads! You know, you're allowed to say you don't have a clue. Evan, well, Swiss race is ready. Yes, of course. Good. Go. Oh, God damn it. It was done on purpose. That or the psycho saw his chance and took it. Don't get paranoid on me. Out of practice. Hold it! Stop right there! Slow your roll! River Ward, NCPD. Police. Let him in? It's important. Gotta speak to the mayor's chief of security. Cream, do it after the conference.
terminal crashed right as he went through the gate. The glitch was no accident. Nah. Seen stranger coincidences. Like? Like when you bang some chick and then her sister later, same night. <laughs> and it turns out they're both sisters of God. That really happened to you? Nah. But it could have. Cop wanted to tell security something. Probably that he was standing by to lick Ryan's butthole. recognize it tune what he's humming wouldn't call that a tune he's a really into it <laughs> Half the city with what he was packing. Probably what happened. Body disappeared from the morgue, sight unseen. And then some pig got himself a new set of wheels and an ugly ass suit. Know that? Or just talking out your ass again? Once you've seen all I've seen, don't need to know things to know them. People are the same everywhere. Okay, it's coming out your ass. Oh, well, well. <laughs> Fantastic. So, any thoughts? Did you uh, see anything suspicious? Anything at all? Or are we paranoid? Whole thing stinks worse than Coronado Bay in July. Huh. So suspicions confirmed. Any questions at this point? Red Queen's race. What is it? Got me. Never heard of it. Sorry. Who's Holt? Ryan's deputy. And his bulldog, so to speak. I'm running in Ryan's place now. The conference. Why was it held? For no particular reason. Ryan liked the sound of his voice and seeing himself on TV. That sort of thing. As far as I recall, the drop in Night City's violent crime rate was the excuse for this one. Ryan came out to tout it. Sorry, drop? Ryan reclassified Pacifica an independent district. Stats for that part of town stopped counting. Ha, huh, clever. Cop who saved Ryan. Know anything about him? Detective River Ward. Good guy. We worked a few cases together. You want to talk to him, I'll put you in touch. Mayor's Hustle, they in CPD? No. All handpicked by Holt, and on a corpse payroll. But there are ex-cops among them. 
Anyone else besides Ryan's detail have access to the terminal? Hmm. NCPD. That's it. Sheesh. Ward had great timing. Either has crazy good luck or had a source. Got good info. I'm gonna need some of each. Well said. I'm sending you his deeds. If you need anything else, let us know. We'll help. It's a good thing you answered. I could probably use your help. Probably. Fine. I could really use your help. Can we meet? Just tell me when and where. You don't know how good it is to hear that. Swing by the Aldecaldos camp. I'll explain it all. The Aldecaldos? Thought you parted ways. Oh, look, it's a long story. Just hurry over. I'm here. Oops.
V, it's good you're here. What happened? Spit it out. The Wraiths took Saul. The Brick Brain ventured out with a small patrol and never came back. Sure it was Wraiths. We've been observing their camp. We know they're holding prisoners, including someone important. We need to free Saul. I don't know why, but... I felt I could count on you. Always, Pan Am. You and me are chooms. Thought that was clear. Careful, or I'll start believing that. You won't be able to get rid of me. I'll survive, I'm sure. Whatever goodwill you might feel, I'm sure you won't turn down one of the best sniper rifles on the West Coast. A Tektronica Grad. You saw it in action already. That and the gratitude of the Caldos. Sounds fancy. Once you have it in hand, fancy all of a sudden becomes kick-ass. Let's go. Mitch will walk you through the details. Why am I so short all of a sudden? Well, I'll be. Pan Am and V. What's going on there? Her? After what happened to Scorpion, she shows a guess probably for Saul. Ignore that. Hey, Pan Am. Seriously? You really aim to do this? Someone has to. You know you have a piston missing, right? Someone has to. Guys, replenishing your stuff. Where's Mitch? He was supposed to meet me here. He'll be here any minute. Huh. I never mentioned seeking outside help. We can use all the help we can get. Okay, how do you want to do this? Quietly. An open assault would be suicide. Mitch is already setting up the recon. You'll sneak into the Wraith's camp while I cover you. Not going in quiet. Two's all you need. It's not that I don't want to go to serve some raffins up some justice. It's just... Look around! The last attacks left barely half of us standing. Our supplies are stuck outside goddamn Reno, and our gear... Don't get me started. We're up shit creek, static. And I don't know if we're ever gonna find or fashion a paddle. Try. Leader gets nabbed and you what? Hope for the best? 
Rather not think about what you do for the ones at the bottom of your food chain. You're asking for trouble. Leave it! She has a right not to understand. There's Mitch. I floated a drone over the Wraith's camp. Will you take a look, or would you rather keep mouthing off? Let's see what we got here. The Raffins can't see it. Active camo, but that practically inhales battery juice, so make it quick. What's up, Trollsy? I missed you. They found an abandoned cement plant to squat in, with a mass of heavy gear. Locusts would be a better name for them. They fly into a place, strip it of all it's got, then move on. But this time... Do you see the wall? They've added some primitive security measures. It points to them aiming to stay longer. The question is why. Who knows for sure, but I would guess that Saul is part of the reason. If he's still there, we have to find a way inside. That guard post is probably connected to the rest of the camp. Our way in? Maybe, but there are also breaches in the wall. Lightly guarded sections. Do you see the tracks? Tire tracks. Their vehicles were moving heavy freight. It could have been equipment. Either that or Saul's not their only prisoner. tracks lead to the truck. Can you scan it? That's probably the one they kept Saul in. The main building. There. Saul must be inside. Quite a spread. Be like looking for a diamond in a hailstorm. If they haven't scrapped and gutted the place for parts, you could access the local camnet. You would just need to find the control room.
The Skywalk. It connects the garage to the main structure. Okay, got some stuff to work with now. <laughs> Is everything clear? Let some things up just to be sure. Sheesh. Okay. The Raffins captured Saul. They're holding him somewhere inside their base. We are the cavalry riding to the rescue, hoping to make it in time. You will strive to slip into the camp while I cover you, but we'll let bullets fly only as a last resort. They are many, we are few, so we'll need to look for any chance to gain the upper hand. You will pull Saul out, and the three of us will ride away at top speed. All clear now? Yep. Let's go get Saul. Perfect. Mitch, is the van primed? I did what I could. Take a tour. <sighs> Solid job. I mostly improvised, actually. Either way, it'll have to do. Hold on a minute, I got one more thing. If you find Saul hasn't flatlined, you'll probably need this. Spike Superjet, a rhino dose. It should speed up Saul's central pump. Hope so. Doubt I could carry him on my back. So that should be everything. V, will you ride with me? Yeah, of course I'm going with you. Okay, you take the wheel. Want me driving? Ugh. Yep, I need to fiddle with my scope a bit. Spin if you like. I can't believe he let himself get captured. Anyone else? But Saul? You said yourself he's not at the top of his form. Yes, but moving civilians across the border during a bombardment? Hijacking a petrochem tanker? Opening the valves? Cranking a few figure eights to set the desert ablaze and give the kids a fun show? That's the Saul I remember. All had our idols. I know. It's just. fucking working with them. Holy 
Do you see that? That is one hell of a storm. Looking bad. Oh, it's bad in more than its look. We have to move quickly. Okay, let's go over the plan again. You slip into the rates. We need to hide the car. Park beside that outcrop. Okay, out. I'll find a place to roost and keep you in sight. You just watch yourself down there. I'm in position. I have you in range.
go easy on you, don't worry. I promise. Fuck. Jesus Christ, that box. Just wasting your time. Son of a bitch. <sighs> All right, well, nothing to turn off in there. I see several heavy hitters. Just wait. Nothing to see just yet. Wait till they give him a taste of the torch. Try to melt it down. Jesus.
this shit again. God damn it. So much for being slow. Right now. near the main structure. That has to be where they're holding Saul. Any progress? Is he singing yet? Riding in the basement a while longer to loosen his pipes. Fucking hell, sure hope so. It's taking too long.
nothing to be shy about. Be it for me.